Hey friends, happy Thursday. So we are here at Walmart to do our weekend warrior bonus. So I got $3 for six offers. I'm pretty excited about that. Um, there isn't a whole lot of new things going on. Definitely a lot of repeat deals, but still some really great deals to pick up. So let's get started. So of course I'm gonna pick up the degree bar soap again. So the four pack is $4.97. I'm gonna use this $2 coupon from coupons.com. So I'll pay $2.97, submit to Ibotta for $1.50 back. And then I'm also gonna to submit to Fetch for $1.50 back. So that's gonna make this bar soap completely free. If your store has the One by Poise liners in stock, you can pick one up for $5.46. Use a $3 coupon from coupons.com pay $2.46, but then you can submit to Ibotta for $2 back. So that would make that just 46 cents. So here's another deal I wanted to show you. So the U by Kotex liners, the 40 count, they're $2.97 each. You can pick up two of them for $5.94. If you still have that $4 off two coupon from the one to smart source, you could use that pay $1.94, but then submit to Ibotta for a dollar back on each one. So that would make two boxes free and a six cent money maker. I'm gonna grab one of these Palmolive Shake and Clean Starter Kits for $2.48. We have a rebate on Ibotta for a dollar back, making this $1.48. All right, so now I'm gonna pick up some Oreos. So there are a lot of different options you can pick up. I'm going to go for these snack sacks here. These are the minis. These are priced at $1.86. I'm going to submit to Ibotta for $1.25 back. It's any size, any variety. But then I'm also going to submit to Checkout 51 for a dollar back. Now on Checkout 51, it says it has to be 7 ounce or larger, and this is an 8 ounce. So I'm going to get back a dollar from Checkout 51. So that's going to make this pack here a 39 cent money maker. Now I'm going to pick up some of this Maxwell House International. So I'm actually going to grab four of these. They're priced at $2.74 each. So four of these are going to total me $10.96. I'm going to submit to Ibotta. We have two different rebates attaching. So I'm going to get back $1.25 times five on each one. So I'm going to get back $10 from Ibotta. But then I'm also going to submit to Swagbucks, getting back a dollar for every two. And this is a limit of twice per week. So I'm going to get back $2 from Swagbucks, and that'll make these a $1.04 moneymaker. I'm gonna grab these French style green beans for 50 cents. We have a 10 cent and a bean rebate that is attaching, making this just 40 cents. I'm also gonna grab these seafood snackers again for a dollar. I'll pay that and submit to Ibotta for 50 cents back, making this just 50 cents. All right, so this is everything I'm gonna be picking up at Walmart today for my weekend warrior. So we have no coupons besides that degree bar soap coupon. Everything is just rebates and that's pretty freaking awesome. So let's check out and then go over my receipt. All right, so here we are with this goodness. Um, this was actually a pretty fun rebate haul. Oh my gosh. I just noticed this is like blue themed. So <laughs> I think everything I got has like blue on it. Um, but I was watching some videos, um, I guess with these, that there's certain ones that are double attaching in the app, but then when you submit it, it's not picking any of them up. So I picked up this one here, and when I submitted my receipt, it picked up both of them just fine. And then I did pick up this one on my husband's account. I picked up four of these, and these picked up just fine when I submitted my receipt. Now, I was super happy to see sugar-free, but why does it have to be decaf? Yeah, I was I was pretty disappointed about that. So, but yeah, this is the only sugar-free one, but it's decaf. So anyway, still a nice money maker on those. I'll probably give them to my mom to take to work because a lot of times they get hit mandatory and they have to work like 16 hours straight. So yeah, I think I'm going to give those to my mom. But other than that, I only used that one coupon for the degree. Everything else was just rebates, which is also nice.
So let me just show you my receipt. So here's the degree, or no, um, that's the Palm Olive for $2.48, the degree for $4.97, my $2 coupon, the snackers for a dollar, the green beans for 50 cents, the Oreos for $1.86, and then all four of those Maxwell House for $2.74 each. So my subtotal was $19.77. I paid $20.10 out of pocket. Then I submitted to Swagbucks. I got back the $2.02. .02. I also submitted to Checkout 51. I got back a dollar. Then I submitted to Fetch. I submitted to my husband's Fetch. He still had some available. I got back a dollar and 58 cents. And then I submitted to Ibotta. I got back a total of $17.35. So that does include my $3 weekend warrior bonus. So that makes everything here, including tax, a $1.85 money maker. So really, really happy with that. Now, if you don't include tax, I think it's a little over a $2 money maker, but I do count tax now in my hauls. So such a small haul, but I feel like this was a fun one. Um, but yeah, that's what I got for you. Let me know if you have any questions. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I will see you in my next video, and until then, stay in coupon mode. Bye.